I yield the floor. Note the absence of a quorum. Nope. I don't note the absence of a quorum. I rise today in support of an amendment. Sorry, I don't have the right. Does, does the gentleman have an amendment at the desk? I do. I, I think we're in, actually I think we're in a quorum call. You may want to ask a unanimous I, consent I, to pull out. I will do exactly that. I ask uh, the I notice the absence of a quorum. Um, I think I understand what you were telling me earlier. Let me just confirm I got this right. There's a part of marijuana that will make you high. That's THC, right? I'm gathered here with dozens of my congressional colleagues because if behind those doors they intend to overturn the results of an American presidential election, we want to know what's going on. So what happened yesterday was a high school prank by a bunch of 50-year-old white men. What is Adam Schiff trying to hide? Seeing these boxes of pizza was, was pretty uh, stunning. There's a lot in this bill that would have helped protect us. Uh, you know, I'm not going to say it's a perfect bill. No, no bill is. Uh, we have a perfect bill. It's my bill, the Honest Elections <laughs> Act. This bill has more red flags than the Chinese embassy. This bill isn't going to be it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Pass this amendment. I yield back. Gentleman yields back. Gentlelady from well, Michigan. Um, uh, I, uh... Well, I'm just shocked. The ranking member, Senator Shaheen, the senator from, uh, uh, Matt, excuse me, the senator from, uh, the senator, New Hampshire, thank you. The senator from New Hampshire, who I know very well. The senator from Oregon. From New Mexico. A wall on the border of New Mexico. And we're building a wall in Colorado. The senator from North Carolina. Excuse me, Alabama. I'm sorry. You don't have a Twitter account under a different name like like, uh, like Senator Romney, do you? I, I've so, got 400, 450,000 people following, following me. Following your real account. And, oh, and, they know, and they know it's Chuck Grass. Call. Everybody knows about my wife. Does anybody know about me? <laughs> Facebook can be sometimes an unkind place, both toward my personal appearance and today apparently toward your haircut. This political ad for hotdogcollars.com would allow me to get my two Yorkies, some new dog collars. Could we have a break after this round? Just up here, I'm drinking a lot of water. <laughs> Do we have enough? Do we have 11? I'm glad nobody on this committee is a doctor because people would be dead. Let's assume you're, you know, when you all, when you were at LSU, I know you all were making fake IDs and, and going to the, I did not say I was. Where's our chart people at? Charts over here? Right here, sir. Okay. Syria, the Mediterranean. There's Greece up here. Just north of uh, Syria, we have Turkey. Go ahead and hold that up there. Just hold, there you go. Southwest of Syria, we have Lebanon, Israel, and Jordan. And here south of uh, Jordan is Saudi Arabia. And uh, over here, Egypt. Get paid by the hour, apparently. <laughs> Let me just look at the next map right there. There we go. I call it peach. I'm not sure what call it. Magenta, I'm not sure what you call that. Georgia, not the state, the country. We'll probably see a lot more Nats folks, Nats fans in the months to come, and Houston Astros fans as well. But ISIS was projecting an image of strength of the world. $103 million less than Bryce Harper's contract with the Philadelphia Phillies. Sheila Jackson Lee, I challenge my colleague that if the Nats win the World Series, she and her staff will wear and take a photo for a full day, at least, in D.C. statehood t-shirts. I accept the gentlelady from the District of Columbia, my dear friends, challenge. Go Strohs! Go Astros! I accept it. And she will wear, if we win, the this shirt is with expired. her staff. Cheer for the Washington Nationals. Go Nats!